We are set to bring you baseball from one of the crown jewels of the sport, venerable Wrigley Field in Chicago. Today, the third and final game in this three-game series between the L.A. Dodgers and the Chicago Cubs. It's Cubs baseball on the show next. Stepping in, Justin Turner. And we are ready for some daytime baseball. Leading off the afternoon for the Dodgers. Third baseman, number 10. And the first pitch of the afternoon misses for ball one. And that's how things get underway here at Wrigley. They charge the Cubs as they take the field here this afternoon. They come in unbeaten and playing well here in the early going. Oh, it's remarkable watching them right now. Everything's clicking. To win eight games in a row, you have to have timing hitting. Great pitching, all the cliches you want to throw in there. Well, in this streak, they're doing it. Three and one. This guy, whoo, he's a good hitter. This is the kind of count gets him excited. And Dan, that's a pretty good example of why he's such a great pitcher. Yeah, stuff. Stuff is obviously the important key to being dominant on the mound, but it doesn't mean a whole lot if you don't have outstanding control to go along with it. But he does, and he really spotted that pitch. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. And low, it's a ball and a strike. Here it comes on one and one. A fastball, and he swings through it to fall behind. Lackey ready with the one two pitch. Softly hit toward the hole. Rizzo takes it in, and he'll take it onto the bag himself. Two gone now here in the first. Shortstop, Corey Seager. Here's Corey Seager. He swings and it's a line drive to left center. Schwarber is there and he'll make the catch. In now is John Jay. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. For the center fielder. John that ball's headed for the gap Jay. in left center. He's got a base hit, possibly more. He'll get it into second. And he's able to hustle his way up to second as he'll reach here with a two base hit. Batting second, the shortstop, Javier Baez. Here's Javier Baez. In the dirt, and now let's see. Throw goes to third, and he is safe at third as he moves up on what's likely to be ruled a wild pitch. Here's the 0 1. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. This could be an instant location pitch that he needs to make. If he does that consistently, he'll have a good night. In the dirt and block behind the plate. Good job there as the count goes to one and two. The one-two pitch. And a good sinker there gets him swinging for the first out. Batting third. Third baseman. Brent. Here's Chris Bryant now. Now a bunt attempt here. Gonzalez is right there. The run is in to score, and they take an early 1-0 lead. Anthony Rizzo stands in now as he rips it on the ground to second. And a good effort on the dive that time, but this will get by him for a base hit. Batting fifth, left fielder. Kyle Schwarber. Into the box now. Kyle Schwarber. Harold Reynolds, this Dodger ball club as they enter play here this afternoon. They are in the midst of a pretty bad stretch as they've dropped six straight coming in. Yeah, Matt, they're going through a little bit of a skid right now. Not playing real well, but you kind of expect that. But you look for something to ignite them, to pull it out of it, win a game. And just really, this is when you really have to think about one game at a time to pull you out of it. And that's through for a hit. Batting six, second baseman. In. Here's Ben Zobrist now. As he'll try to hold back on the swing, but he went around for the first strike. And he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season. Hoping to limit the damage, here's the pitch. Turned on that one and crushed it, just pulled it a little foul. A pause and the 0-2. And a big strike out there as they'll leave a couple of runners on.
Here's Franklin Gutierrez. As the first pitch to him runs a bit inside for ball one. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. Tough one to lay off called a strike. And this is low ball two two and one two balls and a strike here it is inside for a ball as he down the third baseline but this will get foul so they'll do it again three and two and he takes strike three called on the fastball one gone here's Adrian now there's a fastball now that's hit softly down the line to third throw right there and that takes care of Gonzalez two gone now at the plate is Andre Ethier as the first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one he's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest not much behind this as this ball is looped over toward first here's the young catcher Wilson Contreras Wilson Contreras and that is through into right field for a single. Batting eight, catcher John Lackey. Stepping in now, John Lackey. And they indeed have the pitcher bunting here as he gets this one down. Only plays to first, so the pitcher does his job as it's a successful sacrifice. Batting ninth, right fielder Jason Hayward. Here's Jason Hayward now dribbled up the line that rolls foul for strike one here's the 0 1 pitch another one fouled off and he's quickly behind 0 and 2 swing and a miss looked like the knuckle curve there and that's out number two now batting center fielder John standing in now Jay. John Jay as he'll go after a hard sinker that time and falls behind nothing in one it was a double for him in his first turn at the plate wood sets coming at him with the 0 and 1 a wave and a miss from the stretch Thought about it, but he holds up on the knuckle curve one and two. Hey, I know you have to protect the strike zone when you get the count to two strikes, but on an 0-2 pitch that misses by that much, it's pretty easy for a hitter not to swing at that one. That's a nice job of staying alive. A two-strike breaking ball just out of the zone. He was able to put enough on it to get another pitch. Lined hard toward right center. Ethier is there, and he'll make the catch to... Here's the catcher, Yasmani Grandal. For the Dodgers, As he takes catcher. a cold strike at the knees, it's 0 and 1. Yasmani He's ready for Grandal. his first at bat of this early season contest. Hot shot to third and handled for the first out. Batting eight. In now, Second Logan baseline. Forsythe. Logan Forsythe. As the first Whoa, pitch misses man. to him, it's ball one. And he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season. Swing and a miss one and one watching him on the mound. I'm really impressed with what he's doing right now He's been really aggressive and confident over the last couple of innings. That's a nice pitch right there He threw him a breaking ball comes back with the fastball and now he's late now He doesn't know how to adjust He's kind of caught in between you got him set up perfectly That's probably not what he wants to do with two strikes right there with the fastball. He is fortunate. He just fouled it off Throw to first gets him and Lackey looks to be in control here. There are two away. Into the box, Alex, Alex Wood. Wood. As he looks at a fastball that's in there for strike one. Now the 0 1 from Big John. Slider, and that's in there for strike two. The wind up and the 0 2 pitch. Now a fastball swung on and missed, and that. Into the box now, Javier Baez. As he rips it on the ground to second. A dive, but he can't knock it down. It's through for a base hit. The batter, third base. Now he'll step off the rubber and go to first. A dive, but he's back.
Stepping in now. Chris Bryant. Pitch out. Nothing doing. Here comes the 0 1. In the dirt here. Nobody out. Runner on first. And this one's in the dirt. And he'll rein it in as the count moves to one and two. Ready on one and two. And he's bunting with two strikes, but can't connect, so a real wasted at bat there. First baseman number 44, Anthony. Standing in now, Rizzo. Anthony Rizzo. And he puts it on the ground to second. To second for one, back to Gonzalez, but it's a bit too late, and they'll settle for just the one out. Now batting, left fielder, Kyle Schwarber. Into the box, Kyle Schwarber. As the first pitch to him is swung on and missed for strike one. One for one after a single this first time up. Now the 0-1. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And that ball will stay fair, and it's gone. A home run. In now, Ben Zobris. And... Oh, and this one's driven the other way and deep to the corner. And it'll fade just at the end and winds up a long foul ball. 0 for 1 here in the early going. Line drive to center field. Peterson will get there and he puts it away to... Into the box now. Justin Turner. Swing and a liner. Justin foul. Turner. Now the 0 1 from Big John and a sliders in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. And he gets a piece here as this ball is fouled away. The one and two pitch. And another foul ball. And this is swung on and missed, and this fourth inning will start the same way he ended the third with a strikeout, and there's one away. Here's Jock Peterson now. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. 2 and 0. Well, we all know he's not the greatest threat with the bat up there. His numbers certainly aren't that pretty, but hey, I give him credit. He's really working the count right here. Two balls and a strike. Here it is. Right on the corner, a fastball that he takes for a strike. Swing and a looper to left. Schwarber is going to get there. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. Here's Corey Seeger. He'll swing and lift the ball foul off to the left and out of play. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. Awfully close with the slider there, but it's one and one. From the windup, the one-one pitch. Swing and a miss way behind the big fastball. The difference maker in this outing than others is the two-seamer. He's doing whatever he wants to do with that ball. It's moving all over the place. Now another one-two. And he goes the other way with it. High and deep down the left field line. And that nearly would have gotten him on the board. Instead, it's a long foul ball. Well, I think he's trying to get that two-strike fastball out of the zone. Just got too much of the plate right there. Fourth. And the center fielder is under it to make the catch. Leading off for the cup. Here's the young catcher, catcher. Wilson Contreras. Wilson. As he'll take a look at the pitch too low. It's ball one. A base hit in his first trip. Hit to short. One away. The pitcher number 41. John Stepping in now, Lackey. John Lackey. As with one away, he can't make contact on the first pitch. It's strike one. I think he just subscribed to the swing hard in case you hit it philosophy of hitting. As a pitcher, why not? Better than standing up there like you've never held a bat before. Swing and a miss. Looked like the knuckle curved there, and that's out number two. 
Right, Here's Jason Hayward two. now. Jason. Nope. He'll start him here with a changeup, but it's taken for ball one. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Smoked on the ground up the middle. Oh, a diving stop. The throw. Touche, sir. Gutierrez. Here's Franklin Gutierrez. And he's a bit tardy there on the first pitch fastball. It's nothing in one. 0 for 1 after he took a look at strike three in his first plate appearance. Slider and he can't pull the trigger. Two strikes. And this is fouled back and out of play. Another 0 2 home. Oh, a fastball swung on and missed, and for the second time today, he's gone on strikes. Here's Adrian now. Sends that one out of play for strike one. The windup and the 0-1. And he misses with it, one and one. A one and one count, here's the pitch. A fastball that he's way out in front of. A swing and a miss. Well, Matt, they've all seen him at this point, and clearly they're not picking him up much better. Do you see the swing on that pitch right there? Nasty. You know what, Matt? He's been getting most of the pitches. I know he's complaining a little bit on this one, but he's been getting most of the pitches today. He, he should be feeling pretty good about himself. Got him swinging on the fastball there. Adrian Gonzalez goes down for out number two in the top half. Hit it hard, but lined out in his first at bat. And there's a swing and a miss by Ethier. Year. He falls behind nothing in two now. Boy, oh, tough to lay right. off, but he's glad he did. It's one and two now. Wow, that's a tough pitch to take. Oh. And we'll have to leave it there as this is. Leading off for the in now is John Jay. Ran one in on him there as this is hit softly to third. And this inning starts with a solid base hit. Some action in the Dodger bullpen now as it appears they have both a lefty and a right-hander up and throwing. Here's Javier Baez, and he pops up the bunt attempt. Throw on to first in time, one away. Now batting, third baseman, Chris Bryant. Here's Chris Bryant now. As he pops the first pitch foul behind the plate. That was a pretty good pitch on a pitch he doesn't throw very often, or I should say hasn't used in this game, that's for sure. That was a good pitch. And there's a sinker that he just spits on as it misses low. Well, that sinker is normally a really important pitch for him, but it really hasn't been effective so far. It just looks kind of flat. Hard on the ground towards short. Throw on to Gonzalez, and that's out number two. First baseman number 44, Anthony Rizzo. Anthony Rizzo stands in now as he rips it on the ground to second. Forsyth is there. Throw on to the first baseman, Gonzalez. Here's the catcher, Yasmani Grandal. As he'll go after the first pitch to him and comes up empty, it's strike one. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. That's taken. Now it's 0-2. And he struck him out. Good pitch there as he registers his eighth punch out now of the ball batting. game. Second Standing base. in now, Logan, Logan Forsythe. As he'll take strike one on the inside corner. He's 0 for 1 thus far. And here's a swing and a miss as he falls behind nothing in two. Wow, he's cruising right now out there. Four straight punch outs and working on number five. Almost a worm burner as he misses on a low fastball. Ball one. Ball two. Into the windup. Here comes the 2-2 pitch. Boy, and they cannot touch him right now. Five straight strikeouts on the ledger, and there are two away. And this one's chopped foul right at home plate. Here it comes. Rip down the first baseline. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Pedro Baez is into the ball game now as he'll make his fifth appearance of the season here. Into the box, Kyle Schwarber, weak grounder back to the mound. 
Throws in time, and that's out number one. And now some action in that Dodger bullpen as a left-hander has begun to get loose. Here's Ben Zobris now as he'll come up empty there as he misses the off-speed pitch for strike one. No hits to this point. Set to deliver the 0 and 1. Tried to crush that ball and now perhaps needs to shorten up with two strikes. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 0 2 pitch. Oh, and he dusted him off the plate that time. Some mind games being played now. It's 1 and 2. And a fastball swung on and missed as he just reared back there. Two away. The catcher, number 40. Wilson In now, Wilson Contreras. As with two away, he'll swing and miss at a first pitch fastball for strike one. A hit and two tries for him so far. Running hard, he's digging for second. And he will pull into second with a two out double. The pitcher, number 41. John Lackey. Into the box now. John Lackey as he swings and misses at a first pitch fastball. 0 and 1. 0 1 pitch on its way. And that one stayed too low apparently. He's set. Here comes the 1 1. Swing and a miss way behind the big fastball. Set to deal on a ball and two strikes. And the slider just stayed north of the strike zone that time. Ready on two balls and two strikes. Here it comes. Swung on. Standing in now, Justin Turner. As he looks at a fastball on the inside corner for strike one. Oh, for two for him to this point. Swing and a miss on the slider, and he's quickly behind. Nothing in two. And this ball's chopped foul at the plate, and that'll hold the count at 0-2. Tapped up the first baseline. Rizzo over to his left, and good hustle to get over and tag him for the out. Here's Jock Peterson now. Jock Peterson. As he rips it on the ground to second. And that's a base hit. So the perfect game bid ends in the seventh. Stepping in now, Corey Seager, as he will take strike one on the fastball here. No balls in a strike. He's hitless in his two at bats so far. And a whiff at a good slider that time. And he struck him out. The tenth victim set down on strikes thus far. Franklin Gutierrez is in for a third plate appearance as he watches one miss inside. It's 1-0. and oh. And a strike to even the count. 1-1. One and one. Swing and a miss just behind a lively fastball. Now a fastball awfully close, but he doesn't get the call. It's two and two now. And yet another strikeout here. His 11th. Scott Casimir gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seven. In now, Jason Hayward. As he loops under the ball and pops it up. Grandal is right there. One pitch, one away. Now batting, center fielder, Sean Into the box now, Jay. John Jay. Liner towards second. Oh, and he can't come up with it. And a nice job to stay with it that time and get the second out of the inning. Now the Dodgers well, get a right-hander up and throwing in their bullpen. Into the box, Javier Baez. Now a ball hit in the air to straight away left. This is carrying well. Stepping in now, Chris Bryant. He swings and grounds it to short. To his left, Seeger. Throw will go to Adrian at first, and with it, the side is retired. In now, Adrian Gonzalez. As the first pitch to him is in there for a cold strike one. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. Oh, he was fooled that time on the pitch away as he went around for strike two. Ball swung on and hit high down the line in left, but it'll get back in among the crowd, so the count holds it 0-2. Just a touch outside, 1-2. Swing and a liner. Foul. 
Another 1-2 delivery. That one misses, and I think a ballpark full of umpires disagrees. It's two and two. And it's late to his afternoon of work, and the longer this at bat goes, the better chance of him making a mistake. But as a guy starts to tire, they're more likely to lead the ball up. But man, he's been good so far. Schwarber is right there as he puts it away. No problem for the first down. Right fielder number six. At the plate is Andre Ethier. As he looks at a fastball that's in there for strike one. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. And this misses the outside corner, so it's knotted up at 1 and 1. Ready to deal. Here's the 1 1. Fastball taken inside for a ball. 2 and 1 now. This is on the ground over to first. Taken in by Zobrist. And they won't have a play as he reaches it first. Let's see how this is scored. Number nine, Yasmani Here's the catcher, Grandal. Yasmani Grandal, as he will look at a first pitch fastball for ball one. No hits to this point. Ball two. A swing and a miss just out in front of that fastball. The two and one on its way. Way in front of that fastball. Next pitch here will be number 100 through seven and a third. Well, if he gets through this eighth inning, I doubt we'll see him again. You get to the 100 mark, people start wondering if you have the muscle and the strength to get through the rest of the game. I think he's done, but he's done a great job. And he lays off for ball one. Pitch swung on and hit in the air. On the move is Jay. Makes the catch, and that'll retire the side. Anthony Rizzo stands in now. As the first pitch to him is Rizzo. off the plate for a ball 1 and 0. Oh. He's working on a 1 for The wind up and the 1 0 -oh pitch. Fouled straight back. Here it comes on 1 and 1. Oh, had him off stride that time, and it's one and two. Well, that's not a good pitch for him to hit. Look, this fellow's got so much power, but you got to bring the pitch into the zone. Chasing that one there right there, I'd go back and throw it to him again. One and two, here it comes. And a slider runs away from him there, and the count levels it to swinging for the first out. Up next for the Cubs. Standing in now, Kyle Schwarber. And there's a swing and a miss at an off-speed pitch to start him out. Nothing in one. He's two for three and looking for more here. Down and away, ball one. Here's the one and one pitch. Just a bit jumpy that time. Swung on and missed. Pitch on the way. And the slider gets him swinging. Two gone. The second base Here's Ben Zobris now. Ben as he lines it out to center. But this will not get down quickly enough as it's pulled in out. Get Wade Davis please. takes the ball now in inning number nine, looking number to close the door. Chase Utley is going to pinch hit here to lead off the ninth. And with his club already well down, he'll just need to try and get on base here. Goes the other way, and this is in the air out to left. Schwarber over to his right, one down. Into the box, Justin Turner. This will get caught chasing a bad one there at strike one. He could really use a knock here, 0 for 3 in the game so far. Here's the 0 and 2. Again, he sends it out of play. I like the pitch right there. Got him to chase a fastball out of the zone. I'd come back with it again. And he struck out again. That's the third time he's gone down on strikes in this one. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. Peterson. And he takes a good swing at that one as this is sent down the line in right, but ultimately into the crowd of foul ball. Swing and a miss. He struck him out, and that'll do it here as the ball game is over. Well, we watched a really solid starting pitching performance, kept the opposition at bay, and as a result, he's our.
MLB Network's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. Today, the opener of this three-game set between the Pittsburgh Pirates and the Chicago Cubs. Two great hitters lead their teams to battle next on MLB Network. Here's Starling Marte. He will lead this one off today. Leading off the afternoon for Pittsburgh. Center fielder. Trying to bunt his Number way six. on to open the ball game, but he misses it for strike one. HR, the Cubs, as they take the field here this afternoon. They come in unbeaten and playing well here in the early going. They are sizzling hot right now. They look as good as they're going to look probably all year. You don't put together streaks like this. They're looking for 10 games in a row. How many teams have the ability to do that? They're playing great Second ball right now. Left. Man, are they fun to watch. So he ran the fastball by him for the punch out. Starling Marte goes down for the first out of the game. That misses wide. One ball and one strike. From the windup, the 1-1 one -one pitch. 2-1. and one. And the pitch on two and one. Sent toward first. And this will get taken in at first for the second out of the inning. Batting third. And that'll bring third up the versatile Jung Ho Gung. Jung Ho Gung. Fouled straight back. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. And here's a swing and a miss as he falls behind nothing and two. He's not messing around this inning. He's attacking the zone. He's showing lots of confidence. He's 0-2 on this hitter after having two quick outs. Nice job. A wind up and the 0-2 pitch. Good job to spoil that one away and he stays alive. Well, I think he's trying to get that two-strike fastball out of the zone. Just got too much of the plate right there. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three. In now is John Jay. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Leading off for the Cubs. Center fielder. John Skied in the air to straightaway Jay. left. Polanco has a read on it. And that's the first out of the inning. Batting second. Right fielder. Jason Here's Jason Hayward now. Hayward. As he'll take a look at an off-speed pitch here that misses for ball one. And Harold, as we take a look at the Pirates as they take the field here this afternoon, they dropped another one last time out, and in fact, they've won just twice in their last eight tries. Well, Matt, their theme song, I heard it in the clubhouse. On the road again? Yeah, they are. I mean, it was a short home stand, and now they're back out there once again playing game one on the road. They may as well not unpack their bags. This is a tough trip again. A dive, but he can't get it. It's through into the outfield. Throw into second. And he'll make it in there with a two-out double. Batting fourth, first baseman, Anthony Rizzo. Anthony Rizzo stands in now as the first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one. And he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season. The 0-1 on its way. Changeup gets him out in front for strike two. Now that's a big swing. That's what the big fella's supposed to do. Let that go downtown. Let it all fly. He let the dog out right there. I want to see if he calms it down or does it again on this pitch. Good pitch there on 0-2. Breaking ball out of the zone away. Might set up another break. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. And that one is gone on a two-strike count with two away in the inning. Into the box, Kyle Schwarber. As he looks at a fastball that misses off the plate for ball one. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. And here's a fastball inside as the count moves to 2 0 now. Wow, it just doesn't seem like he's being as aggressive as he was before he gave up that home run. Was throwing the ball great. Now it seems like he's a little bit more tentative throwing the ball across the plate. Love the pitch call there. 2 0. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. McCutcheon ranging back. He gets there to make the catch, and that ends the inning. Here's Andrew McCutcheon now. Leading off for Pittsburgh. Right fielder. As he will take strike McCutcheon. one on the fastball here. No balls and a strike. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. That's over, but low, it's a ball and a strike. And that swung on and fouled straight back. Ready on one and two. On the ground up the middle. There to play it is Zobrist. 
throw. Got him, and that's a gorgeous play. Batting fifth. Here's Gregory Polanco. Gregory Polanco. And he's first pitch swinging here as he lines this one into left field for a base hit. Here's the catcher, that Francisco Cervelli, as he'll take one on the Francisco inside corner at the knees at strike one. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. Squared that one up just a little late. He'll try it again from first. Swing and a miss, strike three. The throw. Here's John Jaso now as he takes a cold strike on the black. It's 0-1. He's ready for his first at-bat of this early season contest. Well, he's out in front of that changeup. I'll tell you what, he had the honor of the fastball. The fastball, the pitch before, and back with the changeup. Threw it right past him, a swing in the mid. Here's Ben Zobris now. Second baseman. As he'll get caught chasing a bad one there at strike one. And he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season. Tried to crush that ball and now perhaps needs to shorten up with two strikes. Inside as he might be trying to set him up here one and two. Here it comes. And this will get through into right and he's aboard with a single. Batting seventh, catcher, Wilson Contreras. Here's the young catcher, Wilson Contreras. Shows bunt as he gets this one down. Only play to first, so the sacrifice works that time. Batting eighth, catcher, Mike Montgomery. Stepping in now, Mike Montgomery. And this one's in the dirt. Pro goes over to third. Swing and a miss, and he's in the hole 0-2 now. I think he just subscribed to the swing hard in case you hit it philosophy of hitting. As a pitcher, why not? Better than standing up there. Oh, and meanwhile, this pitch rides too far in and winds up hitting him. Batting night. The touchdown. Addison Russell. Here's Addison Russell. He hits it hard on the ground to the left. And there's a base hit as that gets through into left. And they will hold that runner over at third as he'll move up only 90 feet, but the bases are loaded now, with one away. Center fielder, Sean Shane. In now, John Jay. Fun attempt, but this one might have too much on it. And he'll step on first for the out, three unassisted. All right, fielder number 22, Jason Hayward. Standing in now, Jason Hayward. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Hit hard to third. Gung's got it. Throw in time and the side is retired. Here's Jordy Mercer now. As he looks at a fastball that's in there for strike one. And he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season. Off the plate, one ball, one strike. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. And this is fouled back and out of play. He's clearly looking to hit off the fastball and adjust. That's a pretty good swing after seeing two fastballs now in a row. And another foul ball. And he takes strike three cold on the fastball. One gone. Into the box now, Drew Hutchison. Drew and he's a bit tardy there on the first pitch fastball. It's nothing in one. This lineup is flailing right now. They're having a hard time just making contact, let alone putting the ball in play. And that misses one and one. A one and one count. Here's the pitch. And that one stayed too low, apparently. Well, these are just extra pitches that are just going to add to your pitch count. 
He's not trying to work around him, and no reason to, but sometimes you just lose the strike zone for no apparent reason. Schwarber comes on and makes the catch in shallow left for out number two. Center fielder number six. Into the box, Starling, Starling Marte. Marte. As he will take a fastball in there at the knees for strike one. Looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at-bat. Swing and a miss out in front of a changeup. Chop foul over towards the coaching box. Throws it on strike three for the final out of the inning. Here's Chris Bryant now. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball one. It was a double for him in his first turn at the plate. A fastball that just misses inside. Well, here's a guy we know is swinging it pretty well at the plate lately, and based on those last two pitches, I think I know why. He's doing a great job of putting himself at counts where he's likely to be successful. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. And that ball gets down out near the wall and should be extra bases. And he gets in there standing. He's got himself a double. First baseman number 44, Anthony Rizzo. In now, Anthony Rizzo as the first pitch to him is swung on and missed for strike one. A couple of RBIs for him already and a chance for more here. He's set. Here's the 0-1. Thought he had the inside corner that time, but it missed for ball one. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. And this is going to find the seam in right center and should get to the Ivy for extra bases. The runner scores from second, and he will pull into second with an RBI double. Action now in that pirate bullpen as a left-hander starts to heat up down there. Stepping in now, Kyle Schwarber. And he'll promptly send it in the air out to center field. Marte is under it. One out. And the runner, not tagging, will retreat to second base. The second baseman, number 18, Ben Zobrist. Into the box now, Ben Zobrist. As he'll take a look at ball one. One for one after a single his first time up. One and no pitch on the way. Now he turns on a fastball here and sends it to deep right field. McCutcheon is under it. He makes the catch, and tagging is the runner from second. The relay throw, and he'll go ahead and take third on the fly ball to right, so he's 90 feet away now with two men gone. Wilson Contreras. Standing in now, Wilson Contreras, as he rips it on the ground to second. And that's through into center field, base hit. And the run is in to score from third. Now batting, the pitcher, Mike. Montgomery. Into the box, Mike Montgomery as he swings and misses at a first pitch fastball, 0 and 1. Comes set and the 0 1. And that changeup makes him jump, a swing and a miss. That changeup for the second strike right there is a great sign. When you're struggling like he has early in this game, a swing and a miss. That Josh Harrison stands in. Leading off for Pittsburgh, second baseman. As he takes a Josh fastball off Harrison. the plate for a ball, 1-0. Hit it hard, but lined out in his first at-bat. And a strike to even the count, 1-1. One one. Looked like he was on that one, but it's 1-2. and two. That misses, and we're even at two and two. Hey, I appreciate the fact that he's making him throw a few pitches. Most of his teammates have been hacking at everything that comes their way. And this is swung on and missed in this fourth inning. We'll start the same way he ended the third with a strikeout, and there's one away. He's 0 for 1 thus far. And low, it's a ball and a strike. 
ready to deal. Here's the one one. And he gets a piece of it here but it's chopped foul. Looking to punch him out again the pitch. And he struck him out. Good pitch there as he registers his eighth punch out of the ball game. Here's Andrew McCutcheon now. Andrew as McCutcheon. he'll go after the first pitch to him and comes up empty it's strike one. First two men in the inning have both gone down via the punch out so we'll see if he can fare any better. And he jumps at a change up a swing and a miss. And he's got himself another one as he picks up strikeout number nine here and the side is retired. Here's Addison Russell. Yes, he'll pick on the first pitch and line one back up the middle, and that's a base hit. And this inning starts with a solid base hit. With that, the Cubs get their leadoff man aboard. Wade LeBlanc answers the call from the pen here in the fourth as they didn't get the outing they were hoping for from their starter. In now is John Jay as he pops the first pitch foul behind the plate. He's ready. Here's the 0-1. Slow bouncer to the right side. Scooped up. Throw not in time as he's able to leg it out. All right, builder number Hayward now. Now a bunt attempt here. Throw in time as he's called out on a very close play at second. Up next for the Cubs, third baseman. Brent. And we'll step off and fire to the bag. And the runner back. Here's Chris Bryant now. As he'll try to hold back on the swing, but he went around for the first strike. Two hits and two trips for him thus far. Here comes the 0-1. And this is on the ground is short. Could be two. There's Harrison for one. Relay. Here's Gregory Polanco. Leading out for Pittsburgh. The left fielder number 25. As he will look at a first Gregory pitch fastball for ball Polanco. one. A base hit in his first trip. That one's going to find the seats. Strike one. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Now a swing and a chopper foul right at home plate. Looking for his 10th strikeout. Here's the pitch. Swing and a miss. Five straight strikeouts now, and there's one gone. Here's the catcher, Francisco Cervelli. As the first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. And that finds the target. Nothing in two now. The windup and the 0-2 pitch. And he'll continue this roll he's on. Make it six strikeouts in a row. Gracious. Two away. Here's John Jason now. As with two away, he'll swing and miss at the first pitch. It's 0-1. Looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at-bat. Oh, got him a swing out of his shoes on that one. Nothing in two. Ball swung on and hit high down the line in left, but it'll get back in among the crowd, so the count holds it 0-2. That's probably not what he wants to do with two strikes right there with the fastball. He was fortunate he just fouled it off. Seven in a row. Flat out dominant, and the inning is over. Leading off for the Cubs. Anthony Rizzo Third stands in now. Anthony as he'll look at a breaking ball Rizzo. that misses for ball one. Two hits and two trips for him thus far. Into his windup. Here comes the 1 0. Lifted into the air out towards center field. Marte is under it. One down. Now batting. Left fielder, Kyle. Stepping Schwarber. in now, Kyle Schwarber. As the first pitch to him runs a bit inside for ball one. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. 
Fastball got him to swing through it. It's one and one. You know, that can really be an effective pitch for a guy that has a lot of pop. They're up there looking for a fastball up in the zone, so if you can place it a little above it, they have a hard time getting the barrel up there. The second baseman, number 18, Ben Zobrist. Here's Ben Zobrist now. As he'll try to hold back on the swing, but he went around for the first strike. A hit in two at bats for him at this point in the ballgame. The 0 1 pitch. And this will be fouled away. Drilled right back up the middle. There's Harrison for one. On to first as they get the double play to get him. Here's Jordy Mercer now. Leading off for Pittsburgh. Shortstop. So go after Jordan the first pitch and Mercer. bounce it into foul territory. The wind up and the 0 1. Set up away with the changeup, but it's one and one. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. And he lays off for a ball, two and one. Into the windup, here's the two and one pitch. Swing and a miss just behind a lively fastball. It's the first game of the road trip, and, and it takes a little bit to get an adjustment. You're not used to being that team that goes to the plate right, first to start the game after you've been home for a long home stand. But they Number need 15. to get comfortable now in the new surroundings, or they're going to get blown out of this game. Now a pitch runs in on him here, and all he can do is flare one foul off to the right side. Hit out towards second. Zobris has it and he'll whip this one over to first and he gets his man for the second out. Center fielder Here's Starling six. Marte. Starling Marte. Yes he pops the first pitch foul behind the plate. On its way the 0 1 pitch. And that one stayed too low, apparently. Tell you what, his spot has been the outside pitch right there. And now we're late in the game, and he continues to pound the outside pitch. And it's really working out for him. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Juan Nicasio enters to do the pitching in the bottom of the sixth. Number 12. Here's the young catcher, Wilson Contreras. As he lifts it in the air to right field. Catch is made out there by McCutcheon, and that's the first out. Now it looks like now a right-hander's up and throwing in the Pittsburgh bullpen. Mike. Into Mike the box Montgomery. now, Mike Montgomery. As with one away, he won't catch up with the fastball, and it's 0-1. That right there, Matt, may be the best pitch in baseball. I don't know why people don't throw that high fastball more. It is so difficult for a hitter to raise your hands up and try to get on top of that ball. And before you do all that, it's by you. There to make the play is Polanco, the and there are two away now. Standing Addison. in now, Addison Russell. Russell. As he lays off a fastball too low for ball one. Two base hits, both singles to this point. Hit to third, taken in by Gung. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. In now, Josh Harrison. Leading off for Pittsburgh, second baseman. As he'll take Josh a look at ball Harrison. one. He's hitless in his two at bats so far. And he misses again, 2 0. Oh. That's two close pitches right there, and he just laid off. I think he's sitting on one specific pitch, and he hasn't gotten it yet. Cut fastballs in for a strike, 2 and 1. And here's a ball hit in the air. In there, a base hit. And that'll bring up the versatile Jung Ho Gun. No hits to this point. The 0 1 pitch. And now a pitch hit sharply on the ground. But this will wind up a foul ball, strike two. Again, a fastball out of the zone. I'd come back with it again. And a quick bluff here over to first, but he'll just stare him back without throwing. Here's another one, too. Neither guy willing to give in, and the ad battle continue. 
struck him out. Struck him out again, I should say. His third punch out of the game. Into the box, Andrew McCutcheon. He grounds it sharply to third. On to first, it's a double play. As their woes continue, the inning is over. Stepping in now, John Jay. As the first pitch to him is off the plate for a ball, 1 0. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. Pitch swung on and hit in the air. Polanco giving chase, makes the play, 1 away. The right fielder number 22. Into the box now, Jason Hayward. Swing and he pops him up over toward foul territory. And he'll stay with it to put it away as they get their man here for the second out. Now batting. Third baseman. Standing in now, Chris Bryant. Bryant. As he loops under the ball and pops it up, Cervelli has a play. And that's the third out. In now, Gregory Polanco. The left fielder number 25. As he'll take a Gregory cold strike here on a borderline Polanco. pitch at strike one. One for two in the ball game thus far. This is swung on and lifted down the left field line, but it'll get back into the crowd as he jumps ahead of him now. 0 and 2. Got him. And that's number 15 for the ball game. Here's the catcher, Francisco Cervelli. Francisco. Cervelli. And he gets him to pop it up on the right side of the infield. There to take it is Rizzo, and there are two away now. The batter. Here's Jason. John Jason now. John Jason. As he pops the first pitch foul behind the plate. The windup and the 0-1. Changeup gets him out in front for strike two. Trying to strike him out for the third time. A little bit off the outside. It's one and two. Wow, that's a tough pitch to take. 0-2 fastball just off the corner. And I mean just off the corner. Now another one-two. And that's swung on and fouled straight back. He'll try again one-two. And he struck him out. 16 for the ball game. And the inning is over. Anthony Rizzo stands in now as he'll try to hold back on the swing but he went around for the first strike so far two for three in this one and boy was he ever fooled on that pitch it's 0 and 2 now well that's not a good pitch for him to hit look this fella's got so much power but you gotta bring the pitch into the zone chasing that one there right there I'd go back and throw it to him again throws in time and that's out number one up next for the Cubs Stepping in now, Kyle Schwarber. As with one away, he can't make contact on the first pitch. It's strike one. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. Line toward right center. And that's into the outfield for a one-out base hit. The second baseman, number 18, Ben Sobrand. Here's Ben Zobrist now. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. And they'll have runners at second and third following the one-out double. The catcher, number 40, Wilson Contreras. Here's the young catcher, Wilson Contreras, as he'll try to hold back on the swing, but he went around for the first strike. He's working on a one for two game so far. Comes set with the 0 and 1. And he gets him to swing through that one. He's in control 0 and 2. Well, that's two strikes at the knees, and now you find yourself 0 2. I, I tell you, he's throwing the ball so well, you've got to set your sights down low and look for any pitch down. And he misses there 1 and 2. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. Now batting, the pitcher. Mike Into the box, Mike Montgomery. Mike Montgomery, as he lines it hard to the right side, but out of play. 
Second and third, two away. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0-2. Obviously, he wants to help himself out right here. With two strikes, that's going to be difficult to do. Let's see if he can put the ball in play. In under the hands with a fastball, it's one and two. Now a ball hits sharply toward third. And that is going to get down for extra bases as this will drive home two. And the runner from third crosses the plate. And the second run will score as this suddenly is now a 7-0 ball game. Here's Addison Russell. There's a swing and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Polanco going back. He's there to make the play, and that. Here's Jordy Mercer now. Leading off for the Pirate. He swings and hits it foul off to the right and out of play. In there, and it's 0-2 now. Now the 0-2 pitch. Grounded back up the middle. Throw on to first for the out, and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. David Freeze will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. David Freeze. And who looks like he got the call there on the pitch inside. It's nothing in one. Nope. Off the plate, one ball, one strike. And with one out in the ninth, he's just now coming up on his 100th pitch of the ball game. Hey, this has been a great outing. He's already in the ninth inning. He's going on 100 pitches now. I want to see him complete this game. Finish it out. That's really impressive. Center fielder number six. Starling Marte. Here's Starling Marte. As he will take strike one on the fastball here. No balls and a strike. He's hitless in three at-bats to this point. And he misses with it one and one. Even at a ball and a strike. Him out, and that'll do it here as the ball game is over. Well, we've talked about his dominance all throughout the game, and he ended up finishing what he started. A complete game shutout. He's our top player of the game.
Now from the windy city of Chicago, there's a beautiful look at fabled Wrigley Field. We celebrate Jackie Robinson Day with a great matchup between the Pittsburgh Pirates and the Chicago Cubs. This should be a fun battle to watch, and it'll take place right after this. Here's Starling Marte, and we are ready for some daytime baseball. Leading off the afternoon for Pittsburgh. Underway at the ballpark this afternoon as the first pitch is in there for strike one. They charge the Cubs as they take the field here this afternoon. They come in unbeaten and playing well here in the early going. Well, Matt, it's nice to wake up in a day game and know your ace is going to be on the mound. It's just one of those win days. Seems like you got to the park early, and before you know it, the game's going to be over, and you're going to have a W. So he ran the fastball by him for the punch out. Starling Marte goes down for the first out of the game. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0-2. Skied into straightaway right. Hayward has a read on it. And he brings it in for the second out of the inning. Batting third. And third that'll bring up the versatile Jung Ho Gung. As he'll go after the first pitch to him and comes up empty at strike one. And he's looking to get it going. Off to a bit of a slow start this year. Good hard slider there, but it runs away. It's a ball and a strike. And he lays off the pitch down and away. Ball two. I'm pretty surprised by the location on those last three pitches. The book on him is that he hits the way pitch pretty well. And he just saw three in a row out there. So does he go? And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three. In now is John Jay. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Leading off for the Cubs. Center fielder. Sean High fly ball Jay. out to straightaway center. Marte is under it. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. Batting second. Right fielder. Here's Jason Hayward now. Hayward. Yes, he'll take a look at ball one. And Harold, as we take a look at the Pirates as they take the field here this afternoon, they come into this one in need of some kind of spark to turn them around as they find themselves in the midst of a five-game slide. Matt, I was on a number of losing teams, and this is the game you look for. We got the ace going, finally. It's the day we're going to win a game. And when he throws, and you know you're struggling, you got to win that game for him. Slap hard the opposite way. Polanco. Is in his tracks now as he makes the catch for out number two. Third, third baseman. Here's Chris Bryant third. now. Bryant. As he grounds one briskly to short. Harrison has it. Throw in time and the side is retired. Here's Andrew McCutcheon now. Leading out for Pittsburgh. As he'll take a look at a strike right down the middle in zone one. McCutcheon. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. Swing and a ball hit softly on the ground. But that'll get foul. It's 0-2 now. Now a swing and a miss, and McCutcheon is set down for round number one. Josh Harrison stands in. Now a swing and a fly ball. And this will wind up a foul ball. The 0-1 pitch. Swung on and lifted in the air to left center. On the move is Jay. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. Batting six. Here's Third John Jaso now. John Jaso. As he'll take a look at the pitch too low, it's oh, ball one. Man. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. Looked like a slider, perhaps, but it missed badly, and it's 2-0. and oh. Good swing. Just got to try and straighten that one out. Well, it's clearly on that fastball. He hit that one hard. He just could not keep it fair. And he can't catch the corner here, so he's behind three and one. Swing and a miss. Good pitch, and it's full now. Three and two. And that one's taken outside for a ball. They walked him. So no one, two, three inning here. They've got themselves a two out base runner. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. I uh, had him lunging at that pitch away, and it's one and one now. Nope. No offer on that one. Two balls nope. and a strike. Hitters count now. Here's the two and one. A wave and a miss. A tick behind a good fastball. Heading out towards shallow right. Hayward has a read on it, and the inning is over.
leading off for the Cubs. Anthony Rizzo Third stands baseman. in now. Anthony as he Rizzo. swings and misses at a first pitch fastball, 0 and 1. And he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season. Gets the fastball by him here, and he's in control 0 and 2. Well, there's no doubt what he was thinking on those first two swings, big power swings. Now he's got to dial it back a little bit, try to put that ball in play. Oh, and he has some trouble with it. Batting fifth, left fielder. Into the box Kyle now, Kyle Schwerber. Big man will try to bunt his way aboard. One there, on to first to complete the double play. Batting sixth, second baseman. Here's Ben Zobris ben now. Zobris. As he'll try to hold back on the swing, but he went around for the first strike. He'll try to make something happen with two gone in the bottom of the second. Hit hard back up the middle, and that'll be a base hit for Zobrist. So the bottom of the inning is still alive after the two out base hit. Batting seventh, catcher. Here's the young Wilson catcher, Wilson Contreras. Grounder down the line at third. Throw on to second for the force. Here's the catcher, Francisco Leading Cervelli. Pittsburgh. As the catcher. sinker to him finds Francisco the zone for strike one. Cervelli. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. And a check swing here as he couldn't help himself, and it's ruled strike two. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. Soft liner to the right side, but an easy play there at first as that becomes the first out of the inning. Standing in now, Garrett Cole, as the first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. Well, he doubled up on that slider, so that tells me he's really feeling it at this point in the game. Good chance we'll see a heavy dose of that slider as this start continues. Now a swing and a miss here as he's down on strikes. So it's two up, two down to begin the third. In now, Starling Marte. He was a strikeout victim to open up the ball game. Ball two. Well, that's a good pitch, but you have to get a little bit closer to the plate than that. That's that big sweeping slider. If it was a little closer, you might get a swing. Gregory Polanco would be next if they can keep this inning alive. And he gets this fastball over back to three and one now. Swing and a miss, and the count goes full three and two. Trying to send him packing for the second time. Chop fouled over towards the coaching box. Once again, a 3-2. And a good fastball swung on and missed for strike three. Leading off for Stepping the in now, Jake Catcher. Arrieta. Jake he swings and hits it foul off to the right and out of play. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. A swing and a miss on a ball that jammed him. I think he just subscribed to the swing hard in case you hit it philosophy of hitting. As a pitcher, why not? Better than standing up there like you've never held a bat before. And he'll try and tempt him with one in the dirt, but he'll hold back here. It's one and two. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. Batting ninth. Here's Addison the Russell. Stop. Addison. As the first pitch to him is swung on and missed for strike one. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. Tried to crush that ball and now perhaps needs to shorten up with two strikes. And a fastball swung on and missed as he just reared back there two away. Now batting center fielder. Into the box, Jay. John Jay lifted the other way to left center. Marte on the move. He gets there to make the play, and that. Here's Gregory Polanco. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball Gregory one. Comes into Polanco. this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. And a strike to even the count. 1 and 1. Down low, two balls and a strike. Set to deliver on two and one. A fastball right over the outside corner. Into the windup, here comes the 2-2 pitch. Fastball swung on and missed for the first out. 
Standing in now, Jung Ho Gong. As he'll take a look at a strike on the outside corner, it's 0-1. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. And this misses the outside corner, so it's knotted up at 1-1. One and one. Fastball called strike, 1-2. and two. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. Line down the left field line. But this will be foul. That's probably not what he wants to do with two strikes right there with the fastball. He is fortunate he just fouled it off. And a fastball just a bit up. And that misses, so it's a full count, three and two. Something has to give. Here's the payoff pitch. Oh, a fastball swung on and missed. And for the second time today, he's gone on strikes. Into the box now, Andrew, Andrew McCutcheon, McCutcheon, as he'll try to hold back on the swing, but he went around for the first strike. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Here it comes on one and one. This now is hit to second. Does he have another one, two, three inning? He does. Seven in a row he's set down now with this. Leaving off the in now, inning. Jason Hayward. Right as he sends a soft bouncer to the right side of the infield. No problem here, one away. Up next for the Cubs, third baseman. Stepping in now, Chris Bryant. He swings and hits it foul off to the right and out of play. Now the 0-1. And this is popped foul off to the right and back into the seats. Swing and a miss on the fastball that time. Out number two. Now batting. Standing in now, Anthony, Anthony Rizzo. Rizzo. Turned on down the line. And he whips on it as this ball's right under his glove. Now batting. Left fielder. Kyle Into the box now. Schwarber. Kyle Schwarber. Swung on, and this ball is absolutely crushed. Forget about it. And that's off the scoreboard. What a blast. Here's Ben Zobris now. As he'll try to hold back on the swing, but he went around for the first strike. One for one after a single his first time up. Turned on that one and crushed it. Just pulled it a little foul. Into the windup. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. Line towards center field. And that'll be a base hit for Zobrist. So a nice job there to fight off an 0-2 pitch and keep the inning alive for at least one more batter. Now batting, catcher, Wilson. Here's the young catcher, Wilson Contreras. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Cole sets. Here's the 0-1. A wave and a miss. What a difficult combination. 96 mile an hour fastball. Then it comes back with the curveball. So difficult to not sit on that 90. Oh. And the throw is in time to get him to retire. Josh Harrison stands in. Leading off for Pittsburgh. So go after the first Georgia. pitch and bounce it into Josh foul territory. Harrison. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. Goodness. 0 and 2 now. Now that's what a slider supposed to look like. Great execution starts off the plate and makes him reach. Right back to him, and it's off his shoe. And they'll have no play as he reaches first base safely. Now batting, the first baseman. John Here's John Jason, Jason now. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And that ball gets down out near the wall and should be extra bases. Harrison rounds the corner and is headed home. And they're not going to get him. He's in there at the plate. Now batting, second baseman. Bill Gosselin. In now, Phil Gosselin. As he'll look at a fastball too high for ball one. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Chopped foul over towards the dugout. Fouled off again, and now he's in a 1 and 2 hole. Here's the 1 and 2 delivery. Oh, they really bunch him up on that one as he swings and misses for the first out. Here's the catcher, Francisco Cervelli, as he'll send a ground ball down to third. Fro gets him, two down. 
the batter, Petra. Garrett Into the box, Cole. Garrett Cole. As the first pitch to him is off the plate for a ball, 1-0. and oh. And this is just off the outside corner, ball two. My bet is he's getting the take sign now on 2-0. and oh. If he's having a hard time throwing strikes to the pitcher, you might as well let him work himself into trouble. Over at the knees, and that's the second strike. Trying to hold the lead, here's the delivery. And this one's chopped foul right at home plate. He's ready with the 2-2 pitch. And he's got himself another one as he picks up strikeout number nine here, and the side is retired. <laughs> Off Standing in now, Jake Arietta. As he'll Arietta. fall behind here as he goes after a fastball that might have been out of the zone. It's strike one. There's a fastball pretty close that time, but ruled a ball one and one. A wave and a miss, a tick behind a good fastball. Well, I think his eyes lit up when he saw that pitch coming up at his eye level. Oh, you think? If you've got a good fastball like he does, that location can be really yeah, effective. Is. It looks Coach so tempting to the hitter, Addison. but making contact on that pitch can be very tough. Addison Russell will stand in for the second time now as he looks at a called strike. It's nothing in one. Line drive to center field. But sadly for him, this will head straight to the center fielder as he puts it away without much trouble for the second center out. Fielder. In now is John, John Jay. Jay. As he'll pick on the first pitch and line one back up the middle, and that's a base hit. Up next for the Cubs, right fielder, Jason. Here's Jason Hayward now as he takes a fastball off the plate for a ball one and zero. He's 0 for two in the ball game so far. Lifted the other way out to left center. And he will get there to make the running play. And that's here's Starling Marte. Leading off for Pittsburgh. Yes, he'll Fielder. take a look at ball Starling one. Marte. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. And he couldn't pull that one back as he clearly broke the plane of the plate, and that'll be ruled a strike. And this is hit hard to the right side, but foul. Trying to strike him out for the third time. This is skied into short left center. Schwarber has a beat on it. And that's the first out of the inning. Here's Gregory Polanco. Gregory as he takes a cold strike at the knees. It's 0-1. He's hitless in his two at-bats so far. Tried to get him to go after the slider, but it's 1-1. One one. From the windup, the 1-1 pitch. Foul back. Ready on one and two. Hit hard down the line. Bryant's got it. Throw on to Rizzo is a low one, but Anthony able to bail out his man with a nice save there. Well done. And that'll bring up the versatile Jung Ho Gung as the sinker to him finds the zone for strike one. No hits to this point. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. And he will strike him out. Ten now in the ballgame in the... Off Here's Chris cup. Bryant now. Third baseman. Bryant. This ball will be chopped Bryant. foul. One strike now from Cole. He's Swing right. and a miss. It's 0-2. He hasn't used that pitch much this game. That's one he's been working on the bullpen, and now he's brought it into the game. If he's able to incorporate that in his stuff, look out. Oh, and he dusted him off the plate that time. Some mind games being played now. It's 1-2. Now the fastball is right by him as he swings and misses for the first out of the inning. Now batting, first base Anthony Rizzo stands Anthony in now. Rizzo. As he hits one on a line to left field. Polanco is right there as he'll put it away without much problem. Kyle Schwarber. Stepping in now, Kyle Schwarber. Oh, forget about this one. Bob Bowie. Into the bleachers and go. And some action now in the Pirates' bullpen. They've got a lefty and a right-hander up to throw. In now, Ben Zobrist. A swing and a drive to center field. That one's got a chance. Gone! 
Yeah, baby. Four to one. Four to one. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Wilson Contreras. As he'll swing and miss at a first pitch slider at strike one. Oh, for two for him to this point. The wind up and the 0 1. Here's a looping fly ball out to right. McCutcheon is there, makes the catch, and the side is retired. Here's Andrew McCutcheon now. Leading off for Pittsburgh. As he'll take right a look fielder. at a strike right down Andrew the middle. It's 0 and 1. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. And that misses 1 and 1. You know, he's one of their guys they rely on to get their offense going. They need a rally, so we'll see if he can spark one here. And this is taken for a cold strike. And he's not in love with that call either. It's 1 and 2 now. Another 1 2 delivery. Again, he sends it out of play. The one and two pitch. Now a fastball, but that's easy to lay off, and it's back to even at two and two. You know, these kind of at bats can drive you crazy when you're on the mound. I mean, he's been ahead of him pretty much the whole time, but he just can't put him away. Not only that, but it's costing him a lot of bullets. Throw in time at first for out number two. Now batting. Standing in now, John Jason. As the first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one. It was a two-bagger for him in his last at-bat. Mm, got him out on his front foot. It's 0-2. Into the windup. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. And he's got another one here. 12 punch outs now in the ball game, and that Tyler Glasnow gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seven. Now it looks like Tyler. Hi everybody, it's Harold Reynolds. Welcome to MLB. Um, so basically, when I go on Twitch, when I go on YouTube Gaming, I'm watching everybody that's playing franchise mode. You know, and I see things that they that they could do better. At. You know, up next for the Cubs, the shortstop, Anderson Russell. Yeah, that's not this. But like I said, now batting. I'm here to win. Center fielder. It's all about Sean winning the game. Right, how you slice and dice it? Right, how you slice and dice it? I'm here to win. I gotta go out there. I gotta win. Everybody else, they don't really care about winning. They don't care about winning. They just don't want to get some subscribers. I care about winning. I got to win. Oh, man. That's cool. That's cool. But, you know, you got Swarber out there, so it's all good. <laughs> yeah, man, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> now batting, catcher, Francisco oh, Cervelli. Hey! D-Rod! But like I said, you know, I'm watching you guys, you know, on, on the uh, Twitch main, the, on Twitch's main page. You guys are playing franchise mode, and, you know. <sighs> Y'all are okay, you know. Not where I'm at, you know. But you, you, got, you guys are all right, you know. Y'all do doing crunch, you know. But, you know, I'm at that Mayweather level, you know. Your attention, please. Because I, I, get, I, get, I got the word of win. I got the word of win, you know. And last night's game, you know, we were, we were uh, down 42. A lot of people would have lost that game. A, a whole lot of people would have lost that game. They would have been like, oh, forget it. But me, I laced up my boots. I came out there, and I got the, and I, I got the victory. I got the victory, you know. That's off the plate. All two. There's a lot of people, you know, they ask me, you know, why, why, you know, why I'm not on the main page.
page of Twitch. I don't know, you know. I feel like I should be on the main page of Twitch, you know. You know, they put in, you know, these other people that are, that are franchise players, and their areas are horrible. The are horrible. You got one dude, I think he's doing the Reds, he's like, like 48 and 48, I don't know, a 48 and 51. We get like, uh, the Yankees, the one dude doing the Yankees. I think like 42, uh, I'm like, 42. okay, okay, you 42, oh, okay, okay, Rivera. but, like, you know, these other people, you know, they're horrible. Leading off for the cup. I'm thinking to myself, right like, how the how heck is y'all on the main page? But, like I said, I gotta go out there. I gotta win. You know, that's what I'm all about. I'm, a, I'm all about winning. I, I'm not sure what everybody else is all about, but I'm all about winning. I just think it's like, I just think it's funny how, like, you know, when people get into like situations and, you know, uh, in franchise mode and, like, kind of how they react and stuff, and I'm like, uh, I, I think I'll do like this differently, you know. I kind of, I could kind of sit back and I could kind of be like, nah, don't, don't do it, and they do it, and they strike out. I'm like, yeah, I, I, would, I would not have done it if I was you, you know, but, you, you know, I'm the... You know, I, I am the, the, uh, the uh, king of franchise, man. But now, hold on now. The reason why I am the king of franchise, man, is because, you know, um, last year was a breakout year for me. Last year was a, was a glorious year. It was a glorious year. You know, um, in the MLB 16 show. Um, I played with the Yankees, the New York Yankees, 2016 New York Yankees, and we went, um, so we went 158 and 40, 158 wins, four losses, you know, I was like, okay, you, you know, we did pretty good, but, but I was, I, I was saying to myself, man, you know, let's try to beat that record, and so I did it with the Chicago White Sox, the 2016 Chicago White Sox, I beat my own record. I beat my own record. 159 wins and three losses. You know, like I said. Like I said. I mean, I'm gonna switch my mouth. Let me switch your mouth. Like I said. I'm the best player at franchise mode. There is nobody better than me. There's nobody better. No matter if you, how you slice it and dice it. I don't care how you slice it and dice it. I'm the best. I am the best. There's, no, there's nobody better than me now. You guys go to other streams, they, they don't lose, you know. You know, we might lose too, but we gonna, we're not going to lose that many games, though, you know. Hey. There ain't nobody better than me in franchise, man. And, and, it's, and, and, and you know, I kind of I kind of have to put this in my mind, you know. I'm like, well, may, maybe there is somebody out there better than me. But then... But then, you know, I, I start looking around at everybody's stream, and everybody's stream is, you know, that I, I see, I see everybody losing, you know, I see, I see everybody losing, I'm like, I'm like, yeah, you, yeah, I ain't better than me, I, I'm the best, I'm the best, when you, when you guys click on franchise mode, when you click on franchise mode, you know, I got my name written all over that mode, all over, all over, you know, I don't want to sound cocky or nothing, but, you know, the numbers don't lie. The numbers don't lie. I, 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 I don't even got to say that. I, I don't even got to say that. Because my numbers don't lie. And plus, I take pictures. I take pictures of my records. I'm not just out here blowing smoke. I take pictures of my records, you know. That's what I do, you know. A lot of people like to blow smoke. I'm like, nah, nah, nah. You're not going to blow no smoke or nothing like that. You know, we want to be real, you know, and let's be real, let's be real, you know, I'm the best, I'm the best franchise player in the world, I'm the best, I'm the main, I'm the best. Shoot, if y'all want to play me, it's going to cost you, it's going to cost you, you know, I'm play for free, y'all crazy, I'm going to play for free. 
you know, um, and uh, also, you know, um, NBA 2K, I'm also the best, uh, my league, my dream player in the world, too. I guess I guess I call it both like my it's it's the, it, it's, the, it's the same thing, you know my league slash my GM player in the world because I went um 82 and 04 times, you know I did it I did it two times hold on a minute hold on I did it three times with the Warriors first time we had Kevin Durant on the team second time the only people that we had on the team the second time was uh, the Splash Brothers. And we had Draymond Green, and that was it. Everybody else, you know, they weren't, you know, all that. But, hey, like I said, Cameron Maven took. Oh, that's fine. Cameron, Cameron Maven, it's all good. I, didn't, I, don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I'm not a, I, I'm not a believer in Carl Edwards Jr. I'm not, I'm not a real big believer in him. I don't, I don't know. I'm not a real big believer in that dude. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Leading off with the Pirates, center fielder number six. Thanks for playing Charlie MLB Martin. The Show. Hi, everybody. It's Harold Reynolds. Welcome to the MLB The Show.
And this is fouled back and out of play. HR, the Cubs, as they take the field here this afternoon, they come in unbeaten and playing well here in the early going. Well, Matt, they're playing good ball. If you look at the standings, they got a nice, comfortable lead. But comfortable can be, it can be trouble. You've got to stay focused, keep your foot on the pedal, and just continue to put that opponent away because this little lead can dwindle quick. Fastball swung on and missed, and the leadoff man has gone on strikes to start the afternoon. Josh Harrison stands in. He's ready for his first at-bat of this early season contest. And this is bounced foul at the plate, and that moves the count to 0-2 now. And this one's tapped foul at home plate. I like the pitch right there. Got it to chase a fastball out of the zone. I'd come back with it again. And a fastball swung on and missed as he just reared back there. Two away. And that'll bring up the versatile Jung Ho Gung. As he will take strike one on the fastball here. No balls and a strike. Looking to at least put the ball in play here this inning. And there's ball one. Swung on and missed. One and two now. Now that's when you know it's a good pitch. He broke off a really nice breaking ball down in the zone right there. And even though this is one of the best hitters around, he waved right through it. And another foul ball. Again, a one-two. Another one sent foul. Just getting things underway here at Wrigley. And he struck him out. So a fine inning here. Stepping in, Matt Caesar. He'll lead things off here in the bottom Ooh, half of the first. Took a wave at one around the shins with no luck. And Harold, as we take a look at the Pirates as they take the field here this afternoon, they are in the midst of a pretty bad stretch as they've dropped six straight coming in. Well, Matt, every team's going to go through a losing streak, but you got to try to do something that's going to pull you out of it. One game at a time is really what you got to think about because if you don't, before you know it, five games leads to 10 and 10 games leads to 15. And before you know it, you're out of it. You lost a ton of games in a row. And a check swing here, but the bat clearly breaks the plane as he set down for the first out. Here's Tommy LaStella now as he'll try to hold back on the swing, but he went around for the first strike. The wind up and the 0 1. A wave and a miss. Got him swinging in the dirt. Cervelli recovers. And the throw is made to record the second out of the inning. Batting third. Third baseman. Here's Javier, Javier Baez. Baez. So go after the first pitch and bounce it into foul territory. Now here it comes. Drilled to the left side. Mercer dives. What a stop. He's up with it. The throw. He is But um, I see you when I see you. Peace. 